So we got Jason from Eustis Roofing, everybody. Um, one of the great roofers out there in the North Central Florida area. Jason, help us out, man, with this question we got from a from the from the text line about this uh, joined roof. Um, somebody has a duplex, man. What you think? Well, so if the roof is joined and you're trying to do um, the roof on one side, not the other, you're going to have a weak point. Wherever the two roofs meet, there's going right. to be a weak point. Yep. You're going to have to t- try to try, tie in to the existing roof on the other side, and then, you know, are you going to damage those shingles trying to do that? So it's just, it's never a good place to be. It's not good for the roof or neither because what side does it leak on if it does leak on? Who's responsible for that? Right. Um, and it does. It never looks good. So that's, a, that's another thing. And then when it comes to a claim, if one side has a claim, almost 99.9% of the time, both sides will get the, the claim approved. Wow. Right, but they either. both have to file that claim. Both got to file the claim. Right. Yeah, but it's you're usually really successful. Uh, the insurance usually always comes through on those situations. Good God. We should just always say that we have a duplex then because they don't come through yeah. on a lot of other Let's people. Let's go knocking on doors <laughs> in neighborhoods with, with uh, yeah. duplexes. Let's go. <laughs> hey, so, Jason, what if, you know, in most of these cases, you're going to have two people that have different insurance carriers. Um, do they need right. to notify? Do How do they get left hand and right hand to talk together? Does that fall on the homeowners, you think? Yes, well, I, I would always, you know, let the adjuster know when he comes out and keep putting that in the paperwork of the claim. Hey, the adjoining duplex has been approved. It's going to get replaced. You know, if you could do it all at the same time, that would be the best way to do it with the same roofer. Yeah, That's right. how you're going to have Absolutely. the best success. That way nobody's pointing fingers like, no, it's his leak. No, it's his leak. So, and how do you renail the decking when you do it? So mm-hmm. how do you know that that guy got his right. side and you got your side done right? So there's a right. lot of code stuff there. So I think one roofer should cover that whole structure. Yeah, I agree. And at the same time, just to, yeah, because you know, it, how, how are you going to tie it in? Well, think about if you I have mean, plywood damage on the other side and it's something you didn't see from an, right. a leak from before. And then all of a sudden you're trying yeah. to post up to a well, the, screwed the, up you know, plywood. The, the sheets yeah. are, are four by eight. So what if half of it's yeah. hanging on over the other side? Exactly. Too? Yeah, right. exactly. Wow. Yeah, it's never a good situation. So I would I would use the same roof for it to do the whole structure. Yeah, and that's good. I mean, and and of course, if the if the shingles are brittle and, and you, you know, you start to break the other side's. Yeah, you're screwed. Yeah, yeah you're. you're well, now just, you own that. I'm really, really, really surprised that they they cover Hold a on, duplex. Me... You know. Well, hey guys, I gotta go. I'm in the soapbox derby, and I'm gonna. <laughs> <laughs> Good luck getting hey, in that car, man. Thanks, Jason. <laughs> well, hey, Jason, uh, looking at us. Uh, uh, and, uh, uh, go ahead and give out your contact information real quick before you go. Yeah. So if you guys are looking for a roofer in Central Florida, it's Eustis Roofing, and its phone number is three five two three four three. 4240. Hit us up on our Facebook. Hit us up on all of our social media. We respond to anybody who has any questions to us. Thanks, that's, Jason. That's awesome. That's great. Man. Yeah, if you guys are listening, go to Eustace Roofing. Go win. Um, and uh, right, solid guys. company. Talk Thanks. You later. See, See you guys. Bye, bye. See you, man. All right. This is great. I have all of this control over here. I can drop people, put them on the air. <laughs> Definitely need to call in right now. Now he's got a power, three, two, power one, shift. 339105. Oh, call in so I can put you now on and then drop you. Just like that. You've got to figure it out. Let's do this. We're going to take a break. We'll be right back.